Hello, welcome to Math with Nile. Today we'll be solving math problems. And what do you have in your hand, Nile? I have a sheet which has the problems on it. So you're going to be reading out some questions. And what if anybody at home wants to join in? What can they do? Um, they can, all you need to do is just have a pencil and paper or a whiteboard and pen and you can try and get the answers right with me. Brilliant. So can you read the first question for us? The height of a tower building is 381 metres. The height of a town hall is 140 metres. How much taller is the tower building than the town hall? Okay, what are you going to do here? So, the question is, I'm going to write it down. 381. Mm -hmm. Take away 140. Okay, can we see the takeaway sign? Oh. Why have you chosen to do subtraction? Because. Why have you chosen to do subtraction? What are the key words there, key phrase that tells you? to do subtraction. How much taller? How much taller is the tower building than the town hall? Yeah. Okay, so you're going to work out the difference between the heights. Okay, so go on. One take away zero equals one. That's easy. Eight take away four. Half of eight is four, so it equals four. 3 take away 1 equals 2, so the answer is 241. 241 what? Um, meters. Very good, Niall. Good job. Vigo and Idris share 36 blueberries equally. How many blueberries does each person get? Okay. So that's half of 36. So why have you chosen to do half? Because if, they're sh if it's sharing equally, yes. so they both have the same number of blueberries. Okay. And what's another way we can say halving? What are we doing? Um, are we dividing, timesing, adding, subtracting? Subtracting? No, if we do No, dividing we're by dividing two. We're dividing it into two equal parts. Yeah. Very good. And let's split 36 into two parts. What can 30 you do? 30 and 6. Okay, so 30. And 6. Okay, so what can you do now to find half of 36? Half of 6 is 3, yes. and half of 30 is 15. And what do you do to the 15 and the 3 now? Um, add them. Add them together. So 5 plus 3 equals 8, and then 8 add 10 equals 18. So, so 15 plus 3 equals? 18. Okay, so can you answer the question... It equals 18. Can you look at the question and now answer it in a worded answer? How many blueberries does each person get? So how would you answer the question? 18. Each, each person gets 18. Blueberries. Blueberries. Very good. Naomi has nine dolls. Amelia has twice as many dolls as Naomi. How many dolls does Amelia have? Okay, so what are you going to do? What is the, What are the important words or word in that question? How many How many dolls does Amelia have? Well, that's what you need to find out. But what's the key word in helping you to work out the calculation? Amelia has twice as many dolls as Naomi. So which bit is important there? Twice as many. Twice as many. Very good. And what does that tell you you're going to have to do if it's twice as many? I'm going to double it. 
9 and 9 and then hmm oh I can just do this I like so 9 mm -hmm. plus 9 equals 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 18. So can you answer the question? How many dolls does Amelia have? Amelia has um, 18 dolls. Very good. Amelia has 23 pounds. And Remy has forty eight. How many how much money did they have all together? Okay, so what's the key word there? Um all together. Very good. What's all together telling us to do? Add them together. Okay, very good. So twenty. You wanna erase that last bit? Okay, good. Twenty three plus. 48 4 8 equals 3 plus 8 equals 11 so I'll put this one here and I'll carry this one so 1 plus 2 equals 3 and 3 plus 4 equals 3 plus 4 equals 4, 5, 6, 7. 7. It equals 7. Okay. okay. So can you answer the question for us? How, mu how much money did they have all together? They have seven, 71 pounds all together. Very good. Artie has 54 sweets. And Flo has 12 sweets. How many more sweets does Artie have than Flo? Okay, what are you um, going to do? 54 take away 12. Subtract, subtraction. And how do you know subtraction? Um, how many more sweets does how many Artie more? Yeah. So there we want to know the difference. Which means subtraction. Mm -hmm. 54 and then 12 and 2 What's the sign? Uh, no. 4 take away 2 equals 2 5 take away 1 equals 4 so the answer is 42 so that means Artie has 42 more sweets than Flo does very good the small plane has 10 rows of passenger seats each row has 4 seats how many people will it take to fill the plane. So what are you thinking? 10 times 4. So if I switch it around, mm -hmm. it could be 4 times 10. Which is? 40. 40. So how did you know it was times that you should do? Um, Can you picture how the plane looks in your head? There would be... 10 rows of 4, 10 lots of 4. Okay, so you've got have 4 seats in each yeah. row. Okay, so you're correct. So what was the answer? Can you answer the question? The, with the answer? answer was 40. Yeah, so. Let's read so it. that means it will take 40 passengers to fill the plane. Okay, very good. A farmer divides 35 sheep between 5 fields. How many sheep are in each field? <laughs> are in each field. Um, so 35 divided by 5? Yes, how did you know it was divided? Um, because he's sharing. Okay, good. Then. So? 
5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 7. So can you answer the question properly? So there are 7 sheep in each field. Very good, nice. A car can carry 5 people to the zoo. How many people can... How many people can eight cars carry? So that means the sum is eight times five. Okay. Um, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty, thirty-five, forty. Okay, so now answer the question. Um, eight cars can carry forty people. Very good. You're getting good at answering these questions. Very good. Okay. The Jones family has eight, has five pigs, two cows, six goats, and fourteen chickens. How many animals does the family have in total? Okay. So what's the key word there, and what do you have to do? In total. Okay, what does total mean? Add them all together. Okay, very good. Okay, so... equals 8, mm -hmm. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 13, 8 plus 5 equals 13, yeah. and then 13 plus 14, 7, and then 1 plus 1 equals 2, so that means they have 27 altogether. They have 27 animals altogether. Yeah. Niall, for some reason, I'm Niall by the way, no. Niall has 145 pounds, that is true, in his piggy bank, he bought a Lego set for 48, how much money does he have left? Okay, so 145, take away. 48. Yes. Um, so basically, 5 take away 8, you can't do that. So I'm crossing out the 4. So it's, so the 4 becomes 3, and the 5 becomes 15. Now, 15 take away 8. Um, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 equals seven mm -hmm. and then three take away four you can't do so that becomes a zero and then 13 take away four equals nine so the answer is i have 97 pounds you have 97 pounds left, left. So that comes to the end of our lesson today, Niall. Hope you got the answers right. Um, and if you didn't, it's still fine. Hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did subscribe now, bye. Don't forget to press this like button. Bye.